Again, my apologies for the previous presentation. Um, I was certain actually I, I actually added the uh, hotel motel. It's highly important. I want this to for you to understand. There's a huge, huge market out there. Lots of old Mitel, old Nortel still. Uh, some old different brand also. So please, um, this actually the reason why I want to take a little bit of time for this is because there is there is a need. I see this on on regular basis. People asking us. Do you have hotel motel environment features that we can throw into, you know, for our customers? So obviously in the telecom world. So the the, the segment is yes, uh, we have different solutions. Yearstar has a fantastic solution for this to to work. I uh, just want to make sure that we're good and we're good to go. Yes, perfect. Right. So um, in this segment, there's different ways of doing things. There's different ways of hooking up the Yearstar overall environment to hotels. Whether you basically just have your own existing IPPBX, all you need is gateways. Please, no problem. You just purchase some gateways, hook up, program it, put an IP address, bingo, it snaps into your IPPBX, existing IPPBX that you already have, know, and, and program. So the, the gateways were fantastic for that. It will support actually most of the analog phones out there. Um, you have to be a bizarre manufacturer for this not to work. So, uh, so it is the used standards in the industry. So, so you keep your existing phones or brand new phone that you buy, regardless if it's a new hotel or an existing hotel. So this all, all the ASTAR segment here is basically into the new gate gateways, basically, uh, analog gateways for your 24 ports or your 32 ports or God knows what. So, so this is actually compatible with your existing IPPBX. Or you say, no, 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 no. I need basically to flip. I need to upgrade, forklift my old Nortel, but I still need some hotel features. Could this, could this work? I have a, a small hotel, motel, maybe a hundred rooms or less, something like this. Um, I just want to change the box, the unit, you know, the existing PBX and make it basically work, uh, for what we need to do. So, uh, please, fantastic. So we'll take actually my PBX, Yeastar my PBX unit will basically slap into some hotel motel features and automatically, uh, we'll throw in some gateways. There we go. And now hook up the existing phones and or brand new phones if you want to, analog phones. And Bergu, you're done. Yes, Yeastar makes with their actually own platform, they makes a fantastic hotel motel add on. For check in, check out things, and we'll see that actually, uh, actually in a few seconds. Um, at that point, so this is very f fantastic for that. Or actually, you say, well, I need a little bit more. I actually will need also a PBX environment, but I need to attach to the existing PMS. I need the PMS to be able to say check in, unlock the phone for long distance, you know, and when you check out, boom, it's actually blocked back for for long distance. So no long distance allowed because you checked out. This way, the uh, team, you know, uh, the team into the uh, the employees cannot use the phone into the room to make calls, personal calls, things like this. So this is what it's made for. Um, you want to basically hook up also the uh, hook up the uh, the wake up call portion. So often the wake up call on the PMS is available, so they're used to that. This is the central heart of their environment or their hotel. It's called property management solution, the PMS. So. The heart by itself, that massive server that handles the paycheck, the handles the accounting, the handles the check-in, check-out, the handles a loss of things. Needs to basically, uh, needs to basically tie to your PBX sometime. In this case, we basically attach a PMS API application. Okay, that will do the middle software between between hi, I'm Yester, and hi, you're a PMS guy. Here's the language we're going to use in between. So this is what it's made for. In case people don't know what it means. At the uh, at the end, so the beauty is actually Yeastar is you know is compatible with more than 100 PMS manufacturer out there in the world. So I'm sure you can find you know your your uh, integration in this in this world. In this particular case, hotel motel sometimes needs a bit more in depth analysis analysis I should say. So in when it do comes in play, please contact us. You know our team will basically be able to help you guide you through what type of integration you need. What's you know if there's a cost associate with this, and if there is what it is and all that, but it is very, very, uh, you know, low cost still at the end. Um, if you just, uh, again, scenario number one was you have your own PBX. We just hook up gateways, hook up your existing analog phones, bingo, you're done. Message waiting lamp will long, will also work on these phones. So, uh, so it is fully supported in different, different, you know, scales, different technology of message waiting indication actually for the phone. So, 
That's pretty standard. That's pretty fantastic, I should say. Uh, we don't see that all the time. Uh, so the, the, well, let's focus more. So in this case, in this segment, hotel, motel, you will need, you're definitely going to focus on the 16 port, all the 32 port massive box. Highly, highly affordable. I, trust me. I've seen some massive dollars into these units, but for Yester, actually, they say, why, why do this? This is what it means. This is the market. This is what we want people that should normally basically pay for the environment for the overall uh, product and that's what it needs to be so it is highly accessible and uh, to this case so message waiting lamp I know sometimes it's being asked phones I mean these are different types of phone we see them VTEX obviously ask for phones uh, the old Nortel phones actually would work also into this uh, if, we look, if we look into the into our, our world, into more of into uh, our country, basically. Uh, features like hot, hot, uh, also hotline. Just uh, we highlight it here, but it's also available on on regular business side of things. But you want the phone to be able to, when you go off hook on your phone, it's an automatic dial. It basically, it's like a a Batman phone, you know, uh, or actually a taxi phone. Let's put it this way. So this basically will allow you to physically. Um, uh, go off hook, it will, it will dial automatically where it needs to dial, and big you're done. So uh, do not disturb features, obviously, is something also that you, uh, you, you basically are doing right now. So this is there. Uh, what else do we have? SMDR for hotel, obviously, is, is something you need, because also Yester offers a full-blown, full-blown, I'm sorry, billing uh, system, which is pretty fantastic. So uh, that definitely needs to be looked at. Let's look at the, to the uh, into the different environments. So Alcatel, as an example, different manufacturers are actually compatible with all this. So, uh, but obviously, what we want is at one point in time we can tie to them. If there's an issue where we need to flip the system for a particular reason, uh, in this segment, by all means, we can slap in basically the Yeastar product or the Yeastar module. But otherwise, just the module by itself can basically attach to that. Uh, or maybe you need a Mitel integration. Maybe you need a Via integration with the PMS right now. So uh, all the different hundred, you know, overall. So it's, it's a, the dictionary, you know, translating Yeastar to the uh, uh, PMS integration is actually there, is on par. Uh, so in this case, we look more tightly into using existing MyPBX over the LAN, over the gateways that we have, and using existing analog phones and or using basically... Um, uh, new phones, if that's the case, right? So that can can definitely be done. Um, if we look into a little bit tighter and a little closer in terms of some feature into the hotel motel, it's there. Um, so the check-in, check-out portion, booking, room groups, yes, it's, it's being supported. Not everybody does that, but actually, uh, the beauty is actually, you start decided to say, well, we'll create a, a a a software to accommodate people that don't have a massive PMS integration system. So we'll we'll accommodate. We'll have our own software. You want it, you know, you can use it. Uh, you want you you want to use your own PMS environment, you can. Uh, you just want to use ours press for the for the wake up call. Hey, no problem. So uh, the wake up call portion actually will be uh, will be there uh, at that point. So so this is is you can just use that if you want to set up the do not disturb on some phones, but use still the PMS for the charging, billing, and checking and all this if you want to. So it's a combination of things. What's important is Yester decided to give you flexibility, tools, power for you to use. You use it the way you want. You use it obviously uh, a la carte according to what you need. Um, what else do we have? Actually, uh, different type of phone, as I mentioned to you, they support lots of phones, you know, analog phones, basically. Teledex is a massive world known in the industry. Telemetrics phones also in some case. Uh, we know Astra, I guess, a little bit on our end, uh, part of the world, a little bit more tightly. So, but still, so, which is now Mitel. Uh, but still, so it is actually uh, something that's being, you know, offered um, and compatible with, which is important. Um, the also the API portion. Uh, so if you need integration with the PMS, as we said, my PBX is there. The new gates gateways are there, and automatically we attach to um, to the existing PMS environment. So again, this is fantastic um, into um, into uh, the Canadian world where we are right now, and for I can make make sure that you're actually you're you're tying up tightly to uh, again this environment. Uh, the, uh, there's different ways of doing things. So again, through an API, basically, it's a third-party API, it's 100, actually attached to more than 100 PMS across the world. So 
highly strong, highly flexible, um, basically to allow you for uh, information onto your, your hotel motel environment. So think about the ESR for hotel. Uh, now you can also now with the price of, of IP phones going down in some cases. So sometime, hey, does it make sense to go analog all the way on a new hotel? Maybe just go, go pure IP in all your hotels and that's it. Uh, you can tie up multiple hotels all together also. So this is the PMS, a couple of example of, you know, the players, Fidelio, highly, you know, from, from Micros, uh, highly known, but there are tons of depending where you are in the country or actually into the, which province you are in, there's some flavor or, that would stand out more than others. Uh, so, so it is, it is available. There's more than 100 of these altogether. So in this case, I just want to do a, uh, a quick pause. Um, basically into this point, uh, I just want to make sure that, uh, we are, um, I have time a bit of questions, so I'll do a pause right now. If you have any questions, and uh, I'll stop the recording for people that this will be on the web. So again, see us back onto the uh, onto the global.ca website and or onto the global, uh, basically, website. Uh, I'm sorry, a YouTube portion. So this uh, segment will be actually on YouTube uh, or to a corporate videos. So GLOB-ALL, type it in, it will be there. Uh, also, I'll do a pause for the recording, but still.